That's me. I liked being to class right on time, so I'd often sprint if I was running late. But if I wasn't, I'd be walking fast. I could tell you about the things I used to feel. It's the thing that makes your heart race when you see certain people in the hallways. That makes the temperature rise by 20 degrees in less than a minute when you can't figure out something that should be so simple. That makes your chest tighten and fall in on itself when someone clicks their pen in an annoying way behind you. I could tell you about the things I used to feel, but that won't really put them into a perspective they deserve. So pay attention, because I'm going to show you. thought it was normal. It wasn't long until I found out how wrong I was. Anxiety. The doctor was very matter-of-fact about it. He didn't talk down to me or make me feel like it was the end of life as I knew it, and neither did my family. They showed me so much loving support. I had an anxiety disorder, planned and simple, and something was to be done about it. I started seeing a therapist not too long after. I'm not going to lie. It was hard. It confronted me in a way that I had never been confronted ever before. And it made me angry. It made me angry because it was like my way of life was being directly assaulted. It took a number of sessions before I could start accepting what I was being told. And even then, I didn't really like going. So I tried seeing someone different, and we just clicked into place. Sometimes, you just need to find someone you feel comfortable with before you can really start accepting change in your life. We talked, we talked, and we talked some more. Just talking about it made me feel so much better. We developed strategies together to help control my anxiety. Ways to defend against it. Over time, the world just got a lot brighter. I didn't have to panic at the sight of certain people anymore. And I found myself getting a lot happier. I saw that there was room for a little disorderly fun sometimes. And being a little late wasn't the end of the world. So if you feel like maybe there's some part of you that shouldn't be there, know that you don't have to be alone with it. Help is out there. So make sure you seek it out.